Good morning, my Positive Thinkers United. I am wearing my robe that Allie got us for the wedding. It was the first thing I grabbed, so why the heck not? Vince, what you doing? You being a troublemaker? You being cute? Well, tell me. It's nice and cold outside? Yeah, I switched out the cushions, so this cushion used to be there, and that one obviously used to be there, but it's not really looking so good. I might have to put that one back and just fluff the crap out of it. But it is Tuesday and going to be a beautiful day. I have to call the auto body shop to see what to do about my car. It's not a crazy big deal. However, it's driving me crazy. Let's make it a great day. So this little guy decided to jump right on my lap while I work on the computer, right? So he just walked into his crate all by himself. You love that little crate, buddy? Yeah, we're gonna have to upgrade to a bigger one soon. Holy cow, I didn't realize how big you were until you got in there. <laughs> See you guys, this makes me feel not as bad putting him in there because he loves it. Don't you, bubby? All right, you gonna be a good boy? Yeah, door's open. <laughs> He's just watching his HGTV. That's it. Aww. So I've got my car cleaned and still it's disgusting because of the rain yesterday, but this is what happened. So my bumper popped out a little bit. Pretty, not, not too bad. Just some scratches. Gotta go to the body shop today. It was freezing in my office and now it's getting even colder outside. It is now 64 degrees. What is that? Oh, it's my little cord. Um, it's 64 degrees right now. It's definitely, whoop, definitely a cool front coming in. I think I'm gonna take Finley for a walk at North Shore today. We haven't been in a while. I might go to the gym with my friend Kelly because we haven't seen each other in quite a while. Actually, she's my little sister. Kelly. Guaranteed oh. to be Oopsie. And I also have to go grocery shopping. I think I'm going to do that now. It's been a long, crazy, busy day. Lots gotten done, which is nice. But I got to go grocery shopping because I'm out. And I'm out of groceries and I'm out of toilet paper. Also, I think my sink is leaking. <sighs> Alright, so turned into a lot more stuff. And this is one of those Publixes that have this. Oh boy. Here we go. Whee! It's like an amusement park. Bye bye. My little cash register lady also is just celebrating her first anniversary with her boyfriend. So happy anniversary. It was cute. I didn't need to use drop up. I definitely was so happy with the first one. I don't even know. <laughs> don't go anywhere. So I got home and decided to start cleaning and now it has turned into, oh yeah, this is Finley's latest. So now it has turned into cleaning the entire couch and moving, yes, <laughs> moving this so that doesn't show anymore. And now Finley is just loving all this space. ready to go <laughs> someone is a little misbehaving today because of the weather and he hasn't been here in a while but look at how beautiful it looks tonight I love this place don't you buddy all right we're jogging good boy decided to make that taco pasta thing tonight again made way too much but oh well I also didn't have corn and I didn't have a full thing of macaroni so I used ZD <laughs> Improvise, improvise, right? So I am drying the bouquet that I ended up 
grabbing, nabbing I'm gonna call it. Somebody t I read that you are supposed to tie it with a piece of floss, oops, piece of floss and then dry it in a dry, cool, dark place. So the closet it was. <laughs> It is time for me to say goodnight. The Lightning won two to nothing in the shootout. I guess if you keep it on long enough, it ends up replaying, because that's what's happening right now. <laughs> um, so Lightning beat Ottawa tonight. We are on the road to the playoffs. I'm just saying, I'm gonna send some good juju to my to my Tampa Bay Lightning because I think I think we might have a good shot. I don't know. We'll see. Um, Thin Man and I are exhausted. It's been another just awesome night. Um, the food was really good, my little pasta dish. I would probably do it a little bit differently next time. I don't know, I don't know what I wanna do differently. There's also a sun-dried tomato chicken dish that I pinned the other day. Um, but yeah, so it's time for me to, s I don't know why, I can't get so it is time for me to say goodnight. I appreciate you guys watching, being a part of my journey. Um, I also want to thank you guys for being continuously so supportive. Oh, that's their goal. I missed their first goal. So yay, I just saw it. He even slid right into the little side. Oh, poor guy. He looks beat up. But anyways, um, I just want to thank you guys for always being so continuous, continuously supportive of my entire life. Um, it's been really fun putting my, my life out to the internet sometimes and having the support that I do. Um, I, you know, I, I see comments often and I don't always want to address them. Um, and then there's some comments that I do want to address and then, you know, it's just... I really want to thank you guys for just being there and although some of your opinions um, I might not agree with like some of them that say like girl you just need to get married well no I don't um, or uh, Finley should do this I don't know no because you want to know why it's me and okay so one thing that I I've learned about myself is um, I continuously put other people ahead of me I've done this my entire life. I constantly worry about what other people think of me, um, their opinions of me. I want to, I want to, I'm a huge people pleaser. Um, and the last few, I'd say weeks, I won't even give myself a month, a few weeks I've um, been more conscious of that. And if I'm not, if I don't want to do it, I'm starting to say no. And although I think that I, I might disappoint people in that process and it breaks my heart to disappoint somebody. However, I'm disappointing myself if I'm not doing something that's from my heart. Um, and I think for a lot of my life, I have always cared so much about making other people happy that sometimes I tend to forget myself. I'm sure a lot of you are like that. Um, so I am doing a conscious effort to just if I don't want to do it, I'm going to say no. And although it might hurt somebody, um, I don't want to hurt anybody physically or emotionally. And I would hope that they would understand that. Um, but I, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be very honest with myself from here on out. And I'm going to surround myself with people who I want to surround myself with, and that brings smiles to my face on a continuous basis. And um, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what happens in the next few weeks, months, years, um, and to document that. Because who knows? There's life is life can do some crazy things. <laughs> but um, thank you guys. I sometimes I go on my little spurts, and this was one of them. I'm clearly very tired, so who knows what's gonna come out of my mouth next? So I'm gonna shut the computer. Yeah, shut the computer off. Mm -hmm. Shut the camera off. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the morning. I love y'all. Bye. You want to say good night? You want to say good night? Good night. Good night. I know.